Okay, so this video will show you how to create a PDF from Microsoft Word. Also how to send them and save them. Uh, so here I've just opened up Microsoft Word and just created this uh, mock resume for example. And the first thing you want to do is press this button up here. So let me zoom in on that. This is at the top left corner. And then I'll give you a few options. Uh, you see save a copy, send a copy, export. It's not as intuitive, you might think to hit export, but actually you're gonna wanna hit send a copy. And right away, you'll be able to see the format you can send this in. So if you wanna keep it in Word document, you leave that there. Uh, otherwise, you can click that and change it to a PDF. So now we have PDF. Uh, you have the option email with Outlook or send with another app. You're gonna wanna hit send with another app and this will give you a plethora of new options to send it. Uh, so right away you can mail your document, uh, use Messenger, copy it to your Google Drive. Um, you can also copy to iBooks, but I'm gonna show you another way that will be better. And down here you have the option of save to files and create PDF. I'm going to recommend to hit save to files. So from here, this will give you two options. You can save it on either your iCloud drive or your iPad. Um, so on your iPad, you'll have folders inside there you can save it. And again, I'm gonna recommend to save it on your iCloud drive. I created a folder here, my PDF piles. And this will give you the option in the future to be able to quickly attach any type of PDFs to emails that you'd like to send. So we're gonna click in here into my PDF files and hit add. So we just created this mock resume. Now let's go into my PDF files and look for that file we just created. Okay, so on your iPad, you're gonna wanna find the files app. Uh, looks like this. It's already comes pre-installed. Go ahead and open that up. And on the left, you'll see all the various places where files can be stored. So let's zoom in there. And again, we're gonna go to, wanna go to the iCloud drive. I recommend saving it on here. That gives you access to all these documents um, on all of your Apple devices. And again, you'll be able to easily send them and upload them. So we see the document that we just created right now, the mock resume is here in PDF form. We open it up and here's our PDF of our mock resume. And now this is ready to send off in an email um, you can upload it to any sort of online job job website and so this kind of makes your iPad a lot more versatile and for myself it's helped me to use my iPad for around 80 to 90 percent of what I do and not have to lug around a larger laptop so if we want to send it we can uh, click up here and again it gives us the option to mail it um, send it a messenger, uh, save it to our, to our drive. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to send it through an email attachment. So we're going to want to open up the email right here. And from here, you're going to hit the compose button. So just the top right. Just create a fictitious email. Okay, and then once you type in uh, your message, or even before that, you just hold down on this area, press down, let go, it brings this up. From there, we hit add attachment, and it brings up all your locations here. Uh, we already have it open to the iCloud drive. Uh, we already have it open to the iCloud drive, but you can just see your iCloud drive, my PDF files, and we have a mock resume. And now we see our mock resume attached to there, and then we go ahead and press send to see my resume. Okay, and here's the last quick little lesson. So let's say you want to add an attachment on a line. And here we have an example. This is a job application. Uh, so we filled it out. That part doesn't matter. Um, but at the end, so again, this is coming from your iPad. Uh, we have a resume attachment. So we can go to Google Drive. However, it's going to ask them for permission to access your Google Drive, uh, which is something you don't want to do. So since we're, we were able to save that PDF file onto our iPad itself, now we can just click on computer. Um, from there, we want to hit browse. So I'm going to upload that PDF file. This comes up again. 
And again, finally, we have all of our options over here. Um, we saved it on our iCloud Drive. So we'll go here into our PDF files. And ta-da. We uploaded it. So the resume is ready to go. And from there, we just hit submit. And we're able to also fill out job applications on our iPad. So again, able to do about 80%, uh, 90% of the things you'd normally do on a regular laptop. And that's how you would create a PDF document using Microsoft Word for them. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know and I will answer them as soon as possible. Hope this helped.